Real quick before I start the video, to celebrate the launch of Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon, I am giving away a Nintendo Switch. This specific Nintendo Switch that is in my hands, I'm giving it away. I can sign the box if you want, whatever. But in order to sign up and enter to win it, all you have to do is click the link down in the description below. Click there, do as many things, uh, options there as you want, and while you're at it, you might as well leave a like on the video and don't forget to comment down below as well. Alright guys, let's move into the video and don't forget to enter to win. Go Retings, Poke fans! Michael here and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Ultra Sun Let's Play walkthrough, my very first journey through this brand new set of Pokemon games. If you are enjoying the series, don't forget to drop a like on the video, I would greatly appreciate that, and also be sure to answer the comment question. And, I did receive this product free from Nintendo. Alright, I said it. We can move on. Um, and if you missed the last episode, of course, make sure you check that out so you know what's been going on. Um, these balloons are hilarious. Especially this mod champ, he's like, Hey! <laughs> I love it. Uh, just lots of colorful flags. Oh, and I am. Spicy. What is this? An Ultra Ball. Solid. All right, well, I think the next step is to go up into Whale of Volcano Park and do the Fire Trial, which is intimidating because my best Pokemon against, ooh, sticker. My best Pokemon against Fire types is a Marini, who does not hit particularly hard. Oh, the Malasada Shop. Oh, I didn't look up what they like. Um, Field Pokemon, you are welcome here. What is this? This is new. Should definitely check this out. They totally give me free things. To the Pokemon fan clothes where people from all around the world gather to show off their photos of their most beloved Pokemon. My favorite's gotta be the lovely Meows to my left. So cute. The more photos you take of your Pokemon with the little photo of the more affectionate they become toward you. Oh! Okay, so once I max affection with Pokemon, I need to show them a Pokemon I've maxed the affection of, which will be very swift once I find once I get access to Rainbow Beans, um, and then I'll be able to probably get like maybe he'll give me a rare candy or something. I don't know. I didn't look up what nature's like what, so I want to see real quick Malasada flavor preferences. <laughs> Malasada. Preferences, Cerebi. I misspelled Cerebi. Because I'm wondering, because I know Halucha likes the sweet ones, but I don't want to go all the way back. Um, I want to see what Marini... Alright. Royal Avenue has dry and sour. And the natures that like those are mild, modest, quiet, rash, bold, impish, lax, relaxed. What do you have? You have impish, so sour. Okay, we need to buy, we need to get you a sour one. And sassy. Sassy likes bitter, okay, that's not till the next place. All right, so we're gonna buy, we're gonna buy Marini a sour malasada and make it love me more. So it gets benefits in battle and so on. Sour. We're gonna feed this to Tex. Yep. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Started happily digging in. There we go, guys. Malasada preferences depend on nature. I wanna see what happens if we try and pet Marini. I feel like it's not gonna go well because it's covered in spikes. Hello. What's she doing down there? Hello. Oh. Ow! Oh yeah, okay, that does hurt. I wonder what its affection at is. I mean, I'm pretty sure a Malasada flavor that it likes will up its affection by one heart. One whole heart. I can't feed it anything because one Malasada fills it up. But let's see if I can get it to... Oh, 
Man, it's letting me pet it a lot before... Because I know it has to change to, like, a... Enjoyment... Once it changes to a music note, that means it's like, this is all I can do for now. <laughs> Come on, Tex. Love me more. Okay, that was less hearts. I bet the next one's a music note. Yep. So how many hearts do you have? You have one. You have one. And you have one. Okay. Once I get fly... I'll probably go back to, um, Melee Melee and get Halucha another sweet Malasada. He's got a sweet tooth. But, uh, let's continue onward. Oh, I should definitely check out the Mega Mart. What do you want? Hey, hey, hey. Creepy pedophile Pokemon. Sales are explosive! Okay, let's see what I can buy in here. Uh, you give me a free berry a day, right? Tomato berries! Those boost friendship, but lower speed EVs. Sweet. Okay, I know the, that guy doesn't sell anything. What do you have? Oh! I should buy some more some more Pokeballs, because I get a discount coupon, so. Nice. Let's get some nest balls too. This is great! Saving money. Living better, Walmart. I hate it when advertising campaigns are effective. <laughs> what do you have? I know, I have a pearl string or something that I should sell. Ooh, let's buy a bunch of repels for cheap. Oh, half price. That's epic. I wonder if they'll... With the discount... I wonder if they'll give me more money if I sell something using the discount coupon. Pearl string. Nope. Alright. Black Friday deals! What do you have? Strange souvenirs. What? Those don't even do anything. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else here to do. Let's let's roll out. Oh wait, there's that, that, uh, that Hypno, like, don't you pay him money and he'll give you a TM? Didn't you just give me one? Thought it was only get one a day. Weird. We'll give him a thousand. It should give me a TM, right? What TM is it, though? Wowzers, you really give me this? Looks like a Hypno, but it's actually just a person wearing a Pokemon costume. Like a Geo Big Spender figured out someone might give me money if I only pretend to be a Pokemon, but I had no luck. Until now, that is. The first big donor I've had, a shining example of humanity. So touched that I got this. Rest. <sighs> I won't give you back your money, of course, but I'd be happy to let you have that! <laughs> Crazy person. Alright, let's roll! Oh, a sticker! Wait, nope, nope, gotta go back, gotta get the sticker. Gotta get the sticker. Sticker, very, very important. Very important sticker. <laughs> Is there anything else behind this building? There's totally something else behind this building. Almost a 30. Yep. HP up. Should use that now while I have it, before my EVs get maxed out. It's got the worst HP. Your HP is bad. More tanky. 
Hooray! Okay. Now, how much time should we spend in the ocean? Or should we just go straight for the volcano? What is that? Is that a magmar? Oh, that was awesome! I just saw magmar walking away from that... Oh, it's still there! Hey, buddy! Hey, hey, look over here! That's... that's so cool. I love that. Alright, I want to see... I feel like there's a much higher chance of there being Pokemon I'm going to want to use here than in... What is that rock here for? Ha! I knew there'd be something hiding back there. Alright, let's see what Pokemon are hanging out here. Last time there were Magby, Kangaskhan, Cubone, Salas... This thing, Salandit. <laughs> I'm not going to use it, because I already have a fire and a poison type. I couldn't get away. Alright, well, time to switch into Halucha and put Halucha in front. <laughs> and keep Halucha in front while I experiment with the, what the wild Pokemon are. Dragon Rage. Ooh, that's OP this early in the game. That's 40 damage right away. No bueno. Okay, let's put you in front, because you're very fast, Nacho. I just heard a Salandit cry. Magby. Okay, that's the same. I'm really looking forward to... I want to see what, like, not in Sun and Moon Pokemon there are going to be here. <laughs> Let's just land it. Come on! More variety! I require it! I require more variety. Vamos. Okay. Cubone? Okay, that's the same. <sighs> Still nothing new. I think I might just like go for the fire trial like and then like do more exploration of like the rest of the mountain and the water area after because I really want Charizard. <laughs> I really want to be able to fly. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to repel though in okay, case so I find anything exciting up on the up on the mountain. But I want Charizard. I want to be able to fly around freely. And I want to be able to go to Poke Pelgo so I can get rainbow beans and max my affection. Ah, I need a super potion. Oh, I should have used, just used two regular potions. Oh, well. Alright, let's put Marini in front. And head up to the top of the mountain. And see how this fire trial goes. Let's see what this item is. Oh, doorbell. Package must have arrived. Which means I can get it after I finish recording. I doubt it's one that requires a signature. And if it's one that's not addressed to me, I can't even open it, because my birthday's coming up and my, Jubilee was like, if the package is not addressed to you, do not open it. Yes, ma'am. A regular Meowth. We'll save time and just switch in and... Brick break! I'm still so proud of myself for using my Halucha against a Love Disc and coming up with the I don't wanna brick break your brick break your heart I don't wanna brick break your brick break your heart Wasn't that awesome? It's so good. So, such a good pun on so many levels. Meowth goes down. Aha! Sightseer Mariah. Oh my gosh, I lost to a trial goer and authentic Alola experience! Yes, indeed. Alright, up the mountain. Hello. Good job making it this high. Why don't we heal your Pokemon for you? Oh, nice! Wanna go back down the mountain? You can cut through the tunnel right there. Let's do it, guys. Let's do this fire trial. And hope it's not stupid hard. 
Hello, Kiawe. I am Kiawe. My Marowak and I are students of the ancient dances that have been passed down in Alola for generations. The trial of Kiawe. You will find that it is a bit different than the trials you have faced at this point, but of course you will attempt it, right? Let's do this! Please don't be too hard. My trial will test your powers of observation. There will be a dance, and then another. Your task will be to find the difference between the two. Alright, so far so similar. I think it... I'm, I'm guessing it's going to be the same type of thing, except the difference is that it's a Alolan Marowak totem instead of a Salazzle. That's got to be it. The middle Marowak. But how? That was really spectacular! Come, Marowak! Wawak! Okay. Let's just use our Water Ream Z right away on this thing. We're gonna do this a lot, guys. This is like this is like my only way to make Marini hit reasonably hard. <laughs> Cause its base special attack is only 53 and it has a special attack lowering nature. This might still one shot. Might? Oh it did! Sick! Way to go, Tex! Alright, so next is the hiker that's photo bombing. So pleased by your right answer, it simply had to battle you. Oh, the hiker's here the first time. What? His facial expression is different. Oh, they're smiling. How that was truly spectacular to add to the spectacle. Come, my fine hiker! <laughs> Alola! <laughs> ah, jeez. So silly. What up, David? Good to see you again. And your Magmar, of course. Alright, Tex. Time for another lengthy Z move. Clear smog. Okay, that did very little. My stat changes were removed. Too bad I didn't change any of them, so it doesn't matter. Alright, Tex, let's do this. Hydro Vortex. There is, like, I think even if you... Does this still... Does it still do the Z-move animations if you turn off battle animations? Oh, man. All right, water pulse. To f this should finish it off from this range. Hmm. I think am I gonna go into the totem battle with that Marini not being at full health? Because if so, that sucks. All right, Tex, way to go. Peter Hiker David, you're a fool if you dance and a fool if you just look on. That's kind of depressing. So please buy a ride, <laughs> my hiker friend. <laughs> All right, let's see. <laughs> They're all doing sorority, sorority squats. That's hilarious. Okay, let's see what's different. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's comical. The the big Pokemon. <laughs> But how? That was truly spectacular! Let's do this! Totem Alolan Marowak. Oh, I have an itch in my ear. <laughs> man, 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 shudder a bit. Speed rose sharply. Okay, there's no way I one-shot this thing. It's so big! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's comical. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna toxic it first. Oh. I'm glad I didn't go for the Z move that turn. 
You're gonna call in a Cubone? What are you gonna call in? A Salazzle! Oh, this is getting real spicy real fast. Okay, toxic, toxic, toxic. Okay, so I can't use toxic again, but... Flame wheel. Alright, so hopefully that decreases the amount of stuff we have to deal with. Okay, I'm not going to go for my Z-move yet, because I'm reasonably confident he's going to go for Detect. And I hope he does. Flame Burst. Okay, he didn't go for Detect, so that actually really sucks, because... The two hits together are not enough for Marini to survive from this range. But I did get the Toxic, so it's only a matter of time. I'm gonna Super Potion again. Burst again. Maybe Flame Wheel will miss or something? I don't know what its accuracy is. Ah, oh, that sucks. Alright, we're just gonna- we're gonna pull some Switch games. Let's go into the rock. Cause I don't think Marini is gonna work out cause it doesn't- it doesn't take the hits well enough. Yeah, the rock takes it better, he's because he's higher level. Let's go for a bite on the Marowak. Okay, the poison KOs from this range. I know it does. Oh the flinch! Oh sick! <laughs> Great for Pikachu. <laughs> Alright, so now... I'm gonna Super Potion on Marini. And then... I'm gonna switch Marini in. Go for Venoshock again, I dare you. That doesn't matter, Marini resists both moves. That should do less than Flame Burst did. I'm pretty sure the power's weaker. Looks like it did, uh, looks like it did about the same. Alright, Salazzle has terrible defenses, so let's hope for the best. Okay, Torment was applied. I don't think the Z-move counts. Because even if this doesn't KO, I'm pretty sure it'll still let me use Water Pulse next turn. Pretty sure. Hydro Vortex. Ah! Alright, you gonna let me use Water Pulse, or did that count? Alright, that did not count! Sweet! We win! Unless for some reason this, like, randomly crits and one-shots? Okay, we're good. Water Pulse. We did it! Yeah! 2v2! We will give Tex some care after the battle. Rocker to level 26. Awesome! That was cool! Man, I can't believe it called in a Salazzle. Mirror Shot. It's like a super inaccurate special steel move, right? Yeah, it is. It's better than Magnet Bomb because it, Magnemite is a special attacker. Woohoo! We did it! Way to go, Marini! I'm super proud of you. Oh, why aren't you the one we're cleaning off?
You guys did great. Let's get you all clean. Marini, come on. Hey, Tex, let's, uh, let's get you clean, too. You participated. Oh. I guess you only clean off one after the battle. All right, never mind. Your enjoyment's too high. <laughs> this is not gonna. This is not gonna help anything. So interestingly enough, in the trailer for the one where it's like the totem stickers, or you can get totem-sized Pokemon, it showed you with a totem Salazzle, which means it's not limited to the totem Pokemon that are in this game specifically. Which makes me really hopeful that I can get a totem Vikavolt. Spectacular! With your keen observations, you were able to see even fine differences! <laughs> and you defeated the Totem Pokemon with such ease! Totem Pokemon protected this Fire AMZ. Now it is yours. Sick! <laughs> I'll probably toss that on uh, the rock before the grass trial. Because so far, the progression of the trials has been exactly the same. I mean, the trials are obviously different. I mean, of the three trials I've done so far, two have had different Pokemon. The Lorantis, I'm 99% sure, is the same. I feel like we saw a scene from the Lorantis trial. Like, the Lorantis sneaking up like it did in uh, Sun and Moon. I'm 99% like sure that's exactly the same. Thank you, my dear Marowak. For when you meet a Pokemon that you would like to make your companion, take these. Yeah! Favorite Pokeball! What's more, you may now use the ride Pokemon, Charizard! Woo! Charizard was registered to your ride pager. Show it to the trial guide outside the captain's barricade at the bottom of the mountain. Alright. Good work, team. Pretty sure we're damaged. Yes, we are. Okay, let's, uh, let's talk to the people. Let's talk to them down here. Because I'm pretty sure this lady will heal my Pokemon no matter when I talk to her. Hello. Yeah! Alright. We can fly, but while we're here, I definitely want to... Uh, there's a hair on my screen. I definitely want to check out what's here. I know there's a TM and stuff. See what this is. To get slightly closer, a float stone. If I'm particularly scared of grass knot specifically, I guess that's a good move. Or low kick specifically. Here we are. There's the TM. Let's see what that is. And grab it. Oh wow, you have logical eyesight. So the Ace Cadabra. Well, this is not a battle that uh, Marini is going to participate in. Well, it's going to participate, but then we're going to switch. Oh, it's Noibat first. Okay. Let's, uh... I don't have any super effective moves on you, so let's just go into the rock. And bite you repeatedly. How does the rock evolve? I think it's lower because, like... It evolved at 17, so that's higher than the average of 16. So therefore, I think it becomes an Incineroar at a slightly lower level. I think like 34? 32, maybe? I don't recall. Okay, let's not hurt ourselves in our confusion, pretty please. Yeah! Okay, just one more of those. Ooh, it's a bite match. Noibat bites back. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't work two turns in a row. Stop it! Come on. Yeah! Alright, he's got this cadaver now. I need you to snap out of your confusion or just attack through it, because there's no way it survives this bite. Come on. Come on, buddy, bite it! Yeah! We did it! Viva la revolucion! We beat Jim! Ah, I blacked out! Oh yeah, I guess that does happen when you lose. Okay, let's see what this is. 
Rock Tomb. No one can learn Smackdown, so I'm... I think it's unlikely anyone can learn Rock Tomb. Oh. A Lucha can. Oh, weird. But can't learn Smackdown. Well, I guess I'll teach it Rock Tomb. I mean, it's probably not... It's not going to be a, that great of a move, but it's, it's physical, and it's a little bit more coverage. I think I'm going to... Should I get rid of Roost, or should I get rid of Wing Attack? Because I never use Roost. Like, I just use a potion. I think I'm going to get rid of Roost. I never... I always just use potions. Alright, well, cool. <laughs> uh, what else is up here? Oh, there's a hiker. We'll battle him. We're about 30 minutes now, but that's fine. Another Solandit. It is the same. So far, I haven't seen a single new Pokemon here. Of course, I couldn't get away. I mean, it makes sense. Mar Marini is, uh, doesn't have legs, so <laughs> it makes sense that it can't really flee from a quick-moving lizard. Excuse me, sir. It's a mountain, I gotta climb it! That's the spirit of a hiker! Logical. I appreciate your commitment to your hobby. Rog and Rolla! Alright! This thing is sturdy. Do Z-moves break through sturdy? I don't think they do. Well, it might have weak armor, so let's try it. Once we finish checking out the rest of the volcano, we'll call it an episode, and I'll check out the little water route to the east of here at the beginning of the next episode. Full force Z-move, Hydro Vortex. <laughs> we're, we're looking at this a lot. <laughs> Definitely glad I taught Water Pulse, though. I, like, wasn't going to because I was like, ah, but my special attack's low. Um, but I'm glad I decided, no, that's dumb. I should still teach it to it. It's better than nothing. Well, that's annoying. Let's use, let's just use Peck. Doesn't matter, it's one HP. Rock and Roller goes down. Calhoun was defeated. He cannot climb me and my Pokemon. That makes sense. I You could probably step on a Marini, but that would really hurt. Okay, there's an item down one of these ledges, I think. And then I think we've cleared this place out. Ha! You better have Burn Heal! Alright. Looks like we're done with Whale of Volcano Park. Wait, can I go to Poke Pelago? I can't yet, even though I have Charizard. Weird. All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna fly back to Melee Melee Island, um, so I can get some Malasadas, and then I'll fly back. You know. I'll do this off camera, but while I'm doing this, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. Make sure you answer the comment question down below, and that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all!